Hi. Hi. I'm about to take you on a ride. For some flat bills. This is gonna be my first flat bill blog. I don't know how many people out there will watch this. I don't really care. I mean, I do, I guess. You know, because I'm putting it out there. But, uh, I just want to know who else loves flat bills. Because I love these things. I just recently got into them. They're the shit. I, I'll show you, uh, my first, or my recent, my most recent purchase. This, uh, Grassroots hat. Grassroots California. Um, I got it at Wakarusa on June 3rd, June 6th. There you can see the grassroots symbol embroidered, you know, uh, right there. You can see the uh, Waka symbol. You can't really see it that well, but the wa like the Waka thing is in the sun. It's embroidered in the sun, the design. Mulberry Mountain. They only made they only made 420 of these hats, and it's got this sweet liner on the inside. It's like bark. It's like orange and brown, and then on the inside right here it says Wakarusa Grassroots. Pretty cool. I don't know. I don't know for sure, but I think this might be sweat proof like material or something. These are like heavy duty hats, feels like. But uh like this, it looks pretty random in this video. I just you know, just picked it up. It is my most expensive hat at thirty-five dollars. Oh sorry, happy beer shield. Anyway, I really, really like this hat. Plan on wearing it a lot. Plan on wearing it out in public because I do it all the time since I've been back. Well, not that long, less than a week, you know. And then this is my most recent after this uh, my Sonic hat, Sonic the Hedgehog. I got it at Walmart because at Walmart. The mouth right here is actually black, but as Spencer's, it's just the same color as this, which is retarded because they they charge ten dollars more. Why the fuck would I pay ten dollars more for the smile to be the same color as the rest of his face? It doesn't even work. Fuck that. Anyway, I also got this custom embroidered with some rings gold rings and my nickname but anyway uh, I got this right before Waka like right before Waka because uh, my buddy got uh, the Flash Gordon hat and he got it embroidered he just got like a lightning bolt like a little lightning strike like right here he got it for nine dollars I got all this for nine dollars and the hat was only ten dollars so this is this whole hat was nineteen dollars but anyway I've also got this sweet pin that I got as a gift from somebody I'm just gonna flash that up real quick because I don't want anybody to look too close but anyway the next one after that my Marley hat. I got this for Christmas in 09. It's pretty cool. Got the Marley on the outside. Make colors, you know, Rasta motherfucker. <laughs> don't don't judge me on that. But anyway, uh, it's got the Marley embroidery on the front. I didn't I didn't get any of this. This is already on here when I got it. I think this is about a twenty or thirty twenty twenty dollar hat. I think. 20 or 25 maybe I got it for Christmas I was I picked it out you know um my mom will just pay for it but anyway like this is like the first one that I like bought at a store I really like it it's been good to me it's white I need to clean it cause it's getting a little bit dirty so I really washed it 
I hear you can throw them in the dishwasher or just like put them in a hat rack in the uh, in the clothes washer. I can't think of the name dishwasher, whatever. But anyway, if somebody could give me some feedback on that, it'd be nice. How to wash properly wash a hat, a flat bill, and keep the bill good. <coughs> Got one more hat. Hold on. I got one more hat. This is a special hat. This is like my first flat bill ever. And I started to wear it. Like my best friend's mom got like a box of ten of these for ten dollars. So like a dollar a hat. You know. It's got the old school clicker, like to and all one size fits all. Um, he gave it to me for free, cause we, but it, you know how we do. We roll tight. <laughs> um, but uh, like all of our circle of friends, our group has one of these hats. Everybody's kind of custom theirs out. Um, but we wear them at concerts. And they're so bright. And they just stand out in the crowd so much. That we can actually find members of our group. Just by wearing them. Just by the hats. Like they stand out so much. I'm 6'3", 6'4". 6'3", 6'4". I don't know. People can see this shit from far away. But uh, mine also has been autographed by Dominic Wally of Big Gigantic and uh, Jeremy Salkin of Big Gigantic right here or no, right here, sorry um, and then one of the guys from Too Fresh I'm sorry I don't know which one just because uh, you know they're twins but anyway uh, also I used to work at Subway I don't anymore, thank you but uh, nothing against Subway. They paid my bills for a while, kept me fed, you know. But uh, kept me lifted. But I I made a name tag, too tall, cause that's my nickname. And I slapped that bitch on there. But uh, this also kind of got like a stash spot. Where you can hide stuff, throw it up there in the net, and it holds it up there kind of nicely. But uh. That pretty much wraps up my video. I hope somebody watches this and comments, gives me some feedback on how to watch the flat bills and keep the bills good. But uh, I don't have any more for now. But there will be more later. Because I'm addicted to flat bills. And I want to know who else is addicted to flat bills. Because I like them. They're the shit. So, give me a holla and let me know what's up. Because I want you. Uh, go to Facebook. Check out the Flat Bill Society. We, uh, I'm the president, so hit me up on that. Because we're always looking for new members who love Flat Bills and STS9. I love STS9. Tis the shit. But I'm running out of time, so I gotta go. Peace out.